Hey guys, in this video I'll show you two methods on how to remove the probably powered by WordPress footer link. This one right here. The first method is with CSS code and for this one we'll be using the WordPress's additional CSS. However, there are multiple ways uh, to edit the CSS code and you can see them in our post which is linked below the video. Now for this one, all you need to do is go to your uh, dashboard, appearance and then customize. Here on the right side you can already see the live preview of your website and this is the link you want to remove. Now for this go to additional CSS and make sure to paste this following line of code which is site info display none. As you can see in the live preview it's, uh, the line is already gone but to make sure just click on publish and then confirm with your live website by refreshing it. There you go, it's gone. Now for the second method I'll remove this line here just so we can um, remove the link once again. Um, speaking of CSS code, this is actually the easiest method, but it's not the best SEO practice per se, as Google doesn't uh, like hidden links, um, which takes us to this second method, which is uh, removing the line uh, from the footer PHP file. Now for this method, I recommend backing up your file or the entire website if you're not familiar with such changes and if possible use the child theme, otherwise you'll make uh, the very same, you'll have to make the very same change every time you update your theme. Now for, um, for the PHP file, all you need to do is, well, go back to the dashboard, to appearance and editor. Uh, now make sure, uh, well, the thing to edit will naturally be the default one, but just make sure it's the one you, you're already running on your website. And then find theme footer, which is footer.php file on the right side here. Click on it. And this is the line you want to be removing. Now, whether or not you're deleting it altogether, just this line here, or just commenting it, like so, um, it will remove the code. So let's try it out update file and then let's refresh the website and there you go it's gone um, now for older themes such as 2016 or 2015 the PHP code you need to remove is a bit different but if you want to know how to remove it make sure to check our post um, this is it guys I hope it was of, of help don't forget to subscribe and follow us on social media links below the video take care and see you next time